We're back with Dr. Ben Springate answering your questions about the coronavirus. And let's get right to our viewer questions. Should we social distance in our own household? Um, I think it's very reasonable um, to consider social distancing in one's household, particularly if someone has to go out to work on a daily basis, for example, they work in one of these critical industries like pharmacies or healthcare or something like that. They're coming into contact with other people. When they come home at the end of the day, you know, it's reasonable to consider social distancing to try to minimize the potential for infection of other people in the household, particularly if someone is at higher risk, if they're elderly in the home or if someone has a chronic illness, but even for others in the home because, you know, if there's asymptomatic transmission, if someone when it's not, you know, coughing or doesn't have a fever, but they can catch the, catch the virus, then there's a possibility that they can spread it to someone else as well. Wow. So to the extent possible, social distancing, if it's, if it's possible within the home, is very reasonable trying to, you know, not share um, the same bathroom uh, materials, towels or washcloths or things like that can be very helpful. All right. Another person wants to know, can bleach kill the virus? Yes, the Centers for Disease Control um, and Prevention website suggests that we should be using um, any of a number of approved products to potentially um, clean surfaces like door handles and the like mm -hmm. in our homes or in our businesses. Bleach, one third of a cup um, mixed with one gallon of water is, okay. an, is an appropriate solution according to that website. So um, people can give consideration to that and try to use an, an EPA approved or CDC approved um, cleaning solution in order to make sure that the surfaces that are around in the home are not potential areas where someone can touch something, put it into their mouth, and get, get the virus. And all those are on the website, all those approved? On the CDC, uh, CDC website. website. Yes. Okay, that's very helpful. Thank you so much.